On this question, we want to find the average rate of change for the function between the given values. The function we're working with is f of x equals x squared plus 3x. And we want to find the average rate of change from x equals 2 to x equals 7. Now the formula for average rate of change is very similar to the slope formula for a line. The average rate of change formula is f of, f of b minus f of a over b minus a. The slope formula is y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. If you look at the average rate of change formula, f of b and f of a are two y values and we're subtracting them and then we have their associated x values in the denominator that we're subtracting. So this is very similar to the slope formula. And the main difference is that with the slope formula, we're going to be using two points on a line. And with the average rate of change, our two points are on this function here, which doesn't necessarily have to be a line. In our example, we're going to let a be 2 and b be 7. And we need to calculate f of b and f of a in order to be able to apply this average rate of change formula. So f of b is f of 7. So we'll substitute a 7 into our function f of x to get 7 squared plus 3 times 7. 7 squared is 49, 3 times 7 is 21, and 49 plus 21 would be 70. Then we'll find f of a. f of a is f of 2. That's 2 squared plus 3 times 2. 2 squared is 4, 3 times 2 is 6, and 4 plus 6 is 10. Now we'll apply this average rate of change formula. f of b is 70, f of a is 10, so in the numerator we have 70 minus 10. In the denominator we have 7 minus 2, that's b minus a. So simplifying the numerator, 70 minus 10 is 60, 7 minus 2 is 5, and 5 divided into 60 would give me 12. So the average rate of change for our function f of x equals x squared plus 3x from 2 to 7 is 12. Thank you for checking out my videos. Have a great day.